Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Today, I have a mic, so you can hear me now, which makes editing videos a lot easier. Today, sadly, we're not doing the AI look at player tutorial, because Unreal kept crashing when I'm trying to do that. Instead, we're going to do some gold watch AI, which was requested. So let's start by adding a blue blueprint class character call it RL GL actor so you go in it there it is and uh, I don't have a, me a static mesh at the moment because this is the first person preset so I'll just add a cube instead This is good. And uh, that's what we need to do in here. Anyway, so yeah, we've done scaling it down and stuff. And we're pretty much done with it. Now, let's create our other assets, which is. In artificial intelligence, we need behavior tree RLGL BT, and we need a blackboard RLGL BB. So let's open both of these first. Now, we have to add a couple of things here. We need a object, call this player ref. This is not gonna work unless you change the key type right here from object to actor, because the player isn't an object, it's an actor. Now, we need to add another variable which is a boolean and as it is we'll call it being being looked at hmm. I, think, uh, I think that's all yes it's not that advanced okay good Let's add a sequence. Well, more of selector. And a sequence right here. Okay. Right click on the sequence and add a decorator. Where is it? Decorator blackboard. Drag off the details tab and set it to being looked at. Being looked at is not set. If it's not, then we'll do this. Observe upwards. On observe upwards, we're going to set this to both. From sequence, well, not now. We need to add a new task. Go ahead and rename that to Get Player Ref. Oh, and before all of that, before we get into the advanced stuff, we need to create one more thing in Blueprint class. All classes AI. AI controller. Select that. Um, GL AIC. From 
here we're going to add a component AI AI perception compile save just to delete all of this stuff click on AI perception right click add event event dispatchers add on target perception updated on here we're going to cast to first first person character on from here we're going to break AI stimulus from here we're going to get blackboard get blackboard we're going to set blackboard value as ooh, where is it? Ooh, first one successfully send uh, key name promote to variable no no don't promote to variable you want to make literal name and we called it Just copy and paste the name. Being looked at. Being looked at. Good. <laughs> this should be all. No. Event on. Possess. You can use event big gameplay if you want, but I just recommend using this. Run behavior tree. Q. All right, now control S compile and turn this off. Okay, crap, now I was supposed to do that. Uh, On here, you want to add an event, receive, okay, on here, you want to add an event, receive, execute. From here, you're going to cast to Object you're going to drag this off and get player character. You're good now. Just need to drag this off here and set the blackboard value as object. And on key, you're going to promote to variable and call this layer ref key select -er. player reference key selector. And from the set blackboard value you guys pulled, going to finish execute success you want to take that as true compile save and go back to your blackboard on here from sequence you want to drag it off 
set task get player reference on here your uh, hmm. that's weird we move it slowly, I think I'm just imagining things let's try move to player reference seconds before restarting the whole thing. on self, go to the details tab, and set AI controller class to RLGL AIC. Don't mess with, don't mess with anything else. Back. Yeah, don't mess with anything else. Drag it off, drop it down into the world, and uh, don't forget to Don't forget to add a nav mesh balance volume. Put a P to see what, you, what you're doing. Just, where's my mouse? Just drag it off through the whole world. The whole, whatever. Oh, now let's just sit down. just made the wrong AI. It should be event tick. Was Go back to our old role goal actor. So you can get an event tick. Another event tick. From here we're going to drag off was. Actor recently rendered. 
target. Get control pawn. Yeah, you have to tick off the context sensitive to get the node. Just connect that to bull fabric. Tolerance. I don't know how to explain that. Well, I don't even know what it is. But I don't think you should bother with that in the first place. So I have What's that? A rerun mode. Compile. Save. What's this to go? 